CT has undergone a major revolution because of technological advances. And we now can produce images like this, whereas five, 10 years ago, we couldn't do anything close to this because the CT scanners are really fast and we're able to time the scan so you capture different phases of the heart as it contracts. You see, this is a contracting heart in place done by a CT scan where you sort of subtracted out all the bones and muscles, okay? But the goal, so what we have been able to do, this is a pretty image, has absolutely no clinical benefit to me. I will never look at this. I'm just put it, presenting a pretty picture to you because it's pretty, it's nice, it's impressive, right? But in reality, what we do is we freeze that motion. That's our goal, and that's what CT, the technological advances, have been able to do. Take that beating heart and stop it so you can see exactly what the coronary arteries look like. And you can see this is, that's the left coronary artery. Everyone see that sort of linear tubular thing coming off of there? And that's the right coronary artery. This is the, by the way, this is the aorta here, and the coronary artery is coming just where your aorta meets your heart. 